Hello and welcome everyone to my YouTube channel. Thank you for dropping by. Today, I'm going to share with you guys on how to top up for your PSN account. There are a lot of methods that you can use. Firstly, you can link your bank account with your PSN account and you can purchase the games directly. But for me, I do not prefer this method because it is not safe. There are a lot of cases happens before to some user. Firstly, Sony auto deduct some amount from the account. So the user need to go through some refund processes and it is very hassle process. Next issue is the PSN S Plus Auto Renew for the subscription. So this one also the user need to go through some refund processes. And the third issue happened to some user which I read online uh, where the user sold the PS without removing the account. What happened is the new user bought every games possible with the previous owner credit card. So for me, linking the bank account is not safe. So we prefer different method. The next method is if you have Maybank account, you can use the Maybank app to buy the code and you can redeem the code into your PSN account. It is very convenient but I do not have any Maybank account so I do not use this method. And the next method which I'm going to share with you guys is by using this gift card method. So this one is convenient and it is safe compared to the previous method. And this gift card you can purchase from the nearest convenience store nearby you which sell this gift card. For me, I bought this gift card from a 7-Eleven store. You might want to check which convenience store that available around you that sell this kind of card. So when you purchase this card, you can scrape at the back part, you can get the code and you can redeem it into your PSN account. So now I have this gift card over here. The price I bought is 100 ringgit and the price that I will have inside the account will be 100 ringgit too. So now look at the back. You will need to scrape this part off to get this 12 digit code and you will need to enter this code into your account. So let me show you how. First you need to log in your account and go to the PlayStation Store, go to the right side click this redeem code option you need to enter this 12 digit code okay all right so now we can see that the code funding amount is 100 ringgit same as the price that i bought okay and then we just click redeem And my total amount after reading this code will be 127.17 ringgit. Okay, so now I successfully added the funding amount. Let's go for the shopping cart. Now I have these two items inside my shopping cart which is Jump Force Character Pass 2. Original price is 74 ringgit and now we have the 75% discount. The price is currently at 18 ringgit only. And we have this PlayStation Plus 12 month subscription. The original price is 159 and currently we have these sales. It is now at 106 only. Okay. Alright. So, just click purchase. Yep, so I already purchased these two items with the Jump Force Season Pass DLC pack and also this PlayStation Plus one year subscription. Okay guys, so that is all the steps on how you can claim or redeem the code from the gift card to put in your PSN account for your shopping experience. If you have any question, you can put in the comment below. If you have any other suggestion or ideas on the content that you would like me to produce, you can also put in the comment below. Please consider to subscribe as it will help me to grow this channel. Thank you guys and see you in my next video.